At their annual conference, Vercel announced Next.js 12, the biggest Next.js release yet. The release has some groundbreaking features, and in this video, we're going to take a look at everything that makes Next.js amazing. A fast refresh and build time is the biggest contributor to a good developer experience. And thanks to a new Rust compiler, Next 12 delivers three times faster refresh and five times faster builds. Don't worry, you don't need to know any Rust. The compiler works in the background. Middleware is a powerful concept that allows you to intercept incoming requests and modify the response. To create middleware in Next12, add an underscore middleware.js file inside your pages folder and add a function called middleware. The function takes an event as an argument and returns the response. When deployed to Vercel, middleware runs on the edge, or in a simpler terms, the middleware runs on a server close to the user making the request, making middleware deployed to Vercel blazing fast. The React team have been working on server components for some time now, and Next.js has unleashed them. Server components are fundamentally different from server-side rendering. Server-side rendering is pre-generating HTML on the server and focuses on the initial render, where server components don't require any client-side JavaScript and are only ever run on the server, making the rendering almost instant. Server components allow you to take the best of both server and client-side rendering to make blazing fast applications that are easy to build and provide world-class user experiences. You may have seen Deno's package system, or lack of, and thought, wow, that's cool. With Next.js 12, you can skip the installs and import modules directly from their CDN. Like Deno, Next caches the modules locally, so you can keep developing offline once the module has been downloaded. If you would like to see a full video on Next.js 12, please let me know in the comment section below. Make sure you've liked this video and subscribed, and turn on notifications so you can keep up to date with all my videos. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.